Now, you'll always want to know what they're up to. No surprises on your way to the border. All right, this is the fastest route. When you get there, cross between these two stations. Now, you have to exit the main road and drive through the desert for a while. But Karen's car should be okay. You got all that? <laughs> she, yeah, she's giving us her car. Sure. I think so. Sean, you have he to has that in memory picture. The police are or a tattoo on your ass. I want to know what it is. You only get one chance here. I'm not trying to be a dick. Just honest. I know, David. Thanks. Here. Have a seat. I don't mean to order you around. Bad habits die hard. And yes, I was suspicious when Karen showed up with you two. But after watching you and your little brother for a while, I think I get what you're going through. Your experience forms you as a person. And I imagine all the shit you've seen and how it's changed you. Pretty much. Not comparing myself, but I had to go through my own hell. In war and at home. I didn't know how to deal with emotions or other people. I'm going to ask about Chloe. Are you talking about your stepdaughter? Yeah. Some rich fucking kid shot her at school where I was supposed to protect her. Me and her hated each other on sight. But once I lost her, everything became clear. How selfish and stupid I'd been. I should have listened to Chloe instead of being a bully. All of my fuck-ups are crystal clear now. But I'm not gonna fuck this up. Sean, I'm gonna do everything I can to help you get out of here. That's my duty now. But I want to be straight up with you, okay? Yeah, of course. I know you guys got screwed. But you think nobody will ever believe you. But the truth is on your side. You and Daniel can't just hide out forever. Is that how you see yourself in 10 years? That's been my question you this whole time. Step up and face the law. You can be free. Sooner. Except Floris didn't believe us at all. Turn myself in? I don't know. I might turn myself in. After I see what happens with Daniel. I know you want to settle down first, but keep your options open. Think about it. And Daniel is growing up fast. Too fast. <laughs> That's what I'm worried about. You made it here. So I know you're on the right path. That's not my phone. Oh, uh, sorry. I really have to take this. Thanks, David. Hey, Joyce. Hey. Right on time. They're still talking. I was gonna make a joke. It's like a hat. Maybe it's Joyce. Totally was. Oh man, I did mess up my blanket. It's all torn up over here. Man, uh, this thing was cool, and I've already destroyed it. News from the vet. Where'd the car go? There it is. Oh, 
was that? Something sounds right next to me. It was very weird. You guys hear that, right? It sounds right next to me. What the heck? Now it sounds like it's over there. <laughs> Is it supposed to be at the truck? But it sounds like it's over there. Okay, old gal. Something is broken. Let's check you out. Well, it's gone now. I think maybe just the too many adults. The audio location tracking or whatever was jacked up. Leave away? Oh, leave away. The name of the place, that's right. After the best everyone hooked us up from their own stocks. Thanks, everyone. So we won't have to stop. Yeah, it was. It was just jacked up the sound. It's funny. Look. Hey. Oh. Need any help? Just checking out the levels and cleaning up the filters. Thanks, Karen. Didn't know you were a gearhead. I didn't know Learn you from, from dad. Oh, Sean, this is basic car maintenance. And I may not be a pro like your father was, but I, I got some solid skills. <laughs> I have to, out here. Yeah, sorry. I'm the newbie. I never really got into cars and stuff. <laughs> Esteban was obsessed with his engines. That doesn't mean you had to be, too. He wanted me to find myself. Yeah. He only wanted me to find my own way. <laughs> Whatever that was. Wish I had more time. Listen, Esteban loved you and Daniel for exactly who you are. He would be proud that you're going back to his homeland today. Wish he was here. Wish he was here with us. It's bullshit that we get to see Puerto Lobos, but he doesn't. I know. But Esteban is still with you, and he always wanted you and Daniel to see where he came from. I don't know anything about Mexico. It's scary. Sean. You're carrying the weight of two people on your shoulders now. It's okay to be nervous. I'm just tired of running. Of causing trouble everywhere we go. Daniel's power is overwhelming, and we don't know where it comes from. But you do know your brother. You'll be there for each other. Uh... Excuse me. I just want this to be over. I just want to get this shit over Eidu. with. So we can start over. If we can. Your brother sure isn't a little kid anymore. He had to grow up too fast. He wants to be equals. And you guys are going to have to work together. He may even help you make it. Maybe you're right. You'll figure it out, like you always do. Okay. Better get back to my tune-up. All right. I'll make one last round before leaving. Oh, we gotta go say bye to all our friends. Come on. 
Hey, what's going on? Mm, I'm taking a look at this baby with hindsight. So, what do you think? Looks very cool. Looks very cool. I can totally tell what you're doing. <laughs> Good, that makes one of us. But I like it. Of course, you, Daniel, you did inspire me. I love it! So, you guys leaving now? Yeah, just wanted to say goodbye. Ah, uh, that's sweet. <laughs> you're so sweet. Your brother is so sweet. Having you boys around was <laughs> the sweetest thing. This is for all your help. Really? Whoa. Heck yeah. That's great. Uh, do I get anything? <laughs> your name is on a way bigger sculpture. For everyone to see. That's true. I didn't think about that. Yeah, your brother needed a little something. A potato. The artist inside. <laughs> Wicked. Okay. One what? big hug. And get out of here before we all start crying like babies. What, mama? Thank you, Joanne, for everything. Just please take care of yourself and my special apprentice. No worries. How do you make so much noise? We always do. Hey, is it okay if I hang out a bit longer? <laughs> if it's okay with her. What, oh, mama potato? So long, Sean. Don't be a stranger. Hi! What are you doing, you big bomby? You, you big bomby? What? Inspiration building all these things with you. Me too. Oh hi. It's the first time I use my power to actually. There you go. Build something. I usually just use it because. Cookie time. Cookie time. Cookie time. Is that what you're waiting for? Is the cookie time? Thank you for cookies. Nom nom nom. Crunch, crunch, mommy. I heard you slurping. Couldn't walk through that bush. Hi, Sean. What's up, you guys? Hey, guys. I came by to say adios. We're taking off today. No, you're not. Really? Everything okay? Yeah, just... Time to go. Well, shit. Wish you and Daniel could stay longer. Too risky. Yeah, but it's too risky. Especially for all of you. We all took a risk moving here. Look, we can hide you from the cops. <laughs> Not the Look at these guys. They're they awesome. My ass. It's better if we leave now. Sean, I won't drag this out and get bitter. Besides... You and Daniel will be back to visit, right? We'll try. We'll try. I'm glad this place will be our last U.S. memory. You and your little brother will always have friends here. And a home. Man, thanks, guys. <laughs> okay, I'm done babbling. I just hate goodbyes. I know you're both gonna have a great life in Mexico. You better. Uh, we... We're gonna make it work. Shit. I'm gonna miss you guys. <laughs> Take care. You hear? Watch out for Daniel. He needs you. Be safe. And send us a postcard to the beach. Thanks, guys. Damn. Daniel just got his mom back. It was always clear. It wasn't forever, honey. They have their own way to go. <sighs> okay, I can't say bye to Dan David. I guess I already did. What bad thing is going to happen to us now?
Daniel, do you copy? It's Daniel. Time to wrap it up. Be right there. Over. So, did you get to say goodbye to away? Yeah. Kind of sad. I know. Are we leaving yet? We have to, and I know. Come here. Mom, I, I'm i going to miss you. I'll miss you too, Danny. Oh, it come was on. amazing to spend this time with you. I'm so damn proud of you both. And what oh, you do with stretches. your life. And if you ever need me, I'm just around the corner. Okay, Mom. Thank you. Well, Sean, this is it. She has teary eyes. I think, yeah, we're going to hug Karen. Thanks, Mom, for being there. Thanks for letting me, son. <sighs> Let's hit the road. No! Everyone's coming out! Oh. Take care, boys! Stay safe! <laughs> Why did everyone have to come out? Stinking life is strange games. something wrong we're almost there okay that's the last time I have to say that I don't care about that so what's the problem what what are we gonna do in Puerto Lobos we don't know anybody we're like strangers how long can we live there New home. Um, as long as we want. We have a house there. That's what Dad wanted, and I know. So, what are we gonna do for money and stuff? Get a job. I get a job, man. It won't be hard. You can probably go to school. Dude, I can't even speak Spanish. How can I make friends or do anything? If I can't talk. Everybody likes you. <laughs> Everybody likes you, Yeah, but, you, man. dude, he's bringing up good points. The cool American kid in no time. I can do that. Maybe. You fit in everywhere we go. And we'll get to hang out, too. Um... Well, that sounds okay. I guess. Daniel... 